today, you can see the research retreat for cancer at UCL. Behind me, there's a huge hub of activity as young scientists interact with senior professors to discuss all aspects of cancer. Cancer at UCL spans basic science through to clinical practice and clinical trials that transform cancer care. It's a fabulous and vibrant environment and all people here are enjoying the day. My name is Pedro Vlissen. Uh, I'm a postdoc and I work with uh, Ron John Chakraverty and uh, Hans Taus at the Royal Free uh, Campus uh, up in Hampstead. The idea of this project is to explore one particular signaling pathway, which is called mTOR, uh, in uh, engineered T cells. So, so we want to further engineer cells that are uh, engineered to kill t uh, tumor cells. And uh, so what we what we've shown here is that by manipulating this uh, this pathway, we can either make the cells better killers, but then they die quicker, or we can make them worse killers, but they stay better. They, more of them stay in your body. So it's a two-edged sword, uh, and hopefully we'll be able to uh, to take the best of it. I'm uh, Lydia Luke. Um, I'm a clinician, so I'm a hematologist, and I'm working at the Cancer Institute with uh, Kui Yong and Martin Pule in the Department of Hematology. I'm looking at the immune system, and um, the immune system has really potent machinery. We've got the ability to kill cells, and, and we know that because we can kill bacteria when we have infections, for example. However, um, what we want to do is redirect that machinery towards cancer cells. So by definition, cancer comes about because it's evaded those mechanisms. And what we're trying to do is redirect um, the immune system to be able to fight cancer cells using your own immune system. I got interested firstly by the, um, I first got interested by the clinical side. So because I'm a hematologist, I wanted to work in myeloma. And UCL has a large dynamic myeloma department. So I approached them because I knew they were doing some interesting work here since the beginning of the Cancer Institute and I head one of the research departments, the Cancer Research UK and UCL uh, Cancer Trial Centre, uh, very much involved with uh, phase three, phase two trials, taking work from uh, the Cancer Institute and from other clinicians within the hospital uh, into multi-centre trials uh, throughout the UK and, and abroad. More recently, I've become the clinical director of the Cancer Institute and my role is very much to help to bring together uh, the work that's going on uh, in particularly in translational research with the clinical work that goes on in UCL hospitals which is a very big cancer center. We're really quite uniquely placed at the Cancer Institute not only being part of a multi-faculty university uh, and funded by Cancer Research UK and one of their Cancer Research UK centers but we are also uh, attached to a very large uh, clinical cancer center um, of UCL hospitals, uh, which is really uh, well known nationally and, and internationally. So we've got the opportunity uh, through the patients that we treat and through the scientists in the Cancer Institute of really developing uh, innovative therapies uh, for these patients. So my new role as uh, clinical director in the Cancer Institute is very much to bring these two uh, parties together and to plan the future uh, for both clinicians and scientists in the Cancer Institute. So this is the sixth annual uh, conference of the Cancer Institute. Um, it's been a very successful day um, and has previous uh, annual in um, meetings have been also because it brings together uh, the scientists the clinical scientists and the clinicians uh, because it's very much uh, a, a conference that spans both the basic science, the translational work, and as we'll hear later this afternoon, some of the clinical activity uh, that's going on uh, within the hospital and the Sarah Cannon Research Institute, which is part of the um, connections that we have through the UCL Cancer Institute. The Cancer Institute is a great place to work because it's large, it's dynamic, loads of interesting things going on and it's great to be a part of it. 